The moment we've all been waiting for is finally here. Ghosts from the Past 2. What's up guys, we're back with another epic video and today we are opening Ghosts from the Past 2, the second haunting with all these amazing cards inside, but first we have a giveaway. Oh wait, not first. Every card you see pulled in this video is in the giveaway. All you have to do is like this video, be subscribed, and let me know your favorite card from Ghosts from the Past 2. There's so many awesome ones. Let's just jump right into it because we're going to be opening a lot of packs today, trying to pull some epic stuff for you guys to win. Just make sure you enter the giveaway. That's all you got to do. Make sure you subscribe to the channel, turn on those notifications. We will be doing streams for this this week so this you're seeing this on sunday if we get some by monday we'll be doing a stream but i don't think we're, we're gonna get it by monday so i think we're gonna be doing it tuesday maybe wednesday thursday i don't know maybe three days in a row if you guys are hyped up enough so make sure you guys check out the streams on youtube so for the first one we're gonna check out the packaging because this is the first time we are opening it so we have oh yeah look there's the dark magician girl we got the blue eyes the dark arm dragon such awesome packaging in these it takes up a lot of extra cardboard but it is really nice looking so you love to see it let's see if we can pull a ghost rare guys these open different than last year you don't open them like gold series oh oh you just dump them out that's interesting let's go let's check out these pack artworks we have cyber dragon that is beautiful whoa man i just love the packaging on these guys they look so good let's see what we can pull in the first pack there's a lot of good cards in here that are not ghost rares as well so we've got the cupid pitch box of friends that's kind of strange sky cavalry i don't know if you i think you get the ghost in the middle track back and desk bot 001 very cool dark magician girl pack artwork this is the card we're really looking for the dark magician girl and of course sdk is the one i want but i think dark magician girl might be the most expensive right now we'll see if that you know holds on dark magician the dragon knight this one did not have a reprint it was out of the legendary decks that's pretty cool legendary hero decks maybe i don't remember which one it was but legendary dragon decks actually yeah so pretty cool. This one has the Red Dragon Archfiend, I believe. Is that what that is? Yeah, Red Dragon Archfiend. Very nice. We've got the Master Hyperion, Vampire Grace, the Maradel. Mardel. We've got the Rare Fish. This is actually only had a common printing in one of the Astral Packs, I think. So that's nice. Insector Hornet. The Insectors are getting a lot of prints recently. Blue Eyes White Dragon artwork. Four mini packs per mini box, or four packs per mini box this time, unlike last year where there was three. So they added one this time. Chimeratic Rampage. Vision Hero Increase is a pretty cool one. That's nice. Agent of Mystery and Ghostric Dohala. Next one of these. This is going to be, when we do these live streams, I'm going to have to do this ahead of time because it takes a while to open up all these mini boxes. Dark Magician Girl. Let's see what we can do. I'm so excited. Come on, guys. Let's get a Ghost Rare. Dramaturs of Despia. That's a good card. Solomon Great Blaze Dragon. We've got the Sacred Waters in the Sky. Plunder Patrol Ship. And the Mecha Phantom Beast Colt Wing, which is now banned. So, interesting that they gave it an Ultra Rare. It did need a reprint, but... Not when you can't play it, so it doesn't really need a reprint at that point. We got the Vision Hero, Poisoner, the Ghost Rick Stein, Odd Eyes Rebellion Dragon, the Vampire Domination, and Flute of Summoning Karibo. That's cool to see that one in there. Six packs in. We have not pulled anything huge yet. We're looking for like uh, Ferris is in here, Vision Hero, or El is it Elementor or Vision Hero? I think it's Vision Hero. Ghost Rick Mary. We got the uh, Doom King. Oh, this card is very good. Baldurok, Zombie card. And then, of course, Chris Shot, Halka Fibrax, you know, stuff like that. There's a lot of good cards. That hopefully we will pull in today's video advanced ritual art ghost trick so cute boss we got the zero we got the ghost trick jang chi and the mystical shine ball so we're too many boxes in so far all right pulls all right guys we got out the rest of this mini box but man these are not that easy to open i don't really know if i like the new strategy of how they sealed these because i am struggling to open these nine pillars of the yang Zing. let's see we got the sandwich in here the time thief temporal wool and Bran and Coltwing again. Very nice. We got the Dark Magician Girl artwork. Very cool. So there's four different part pack artworks, it looks like. Maybe five. Dragon Circle. We got the So Cute Boss. Madrarl, Maddell, and the Vampire Takeover with the Fossil Fusion. That's from Armageddon. Interesting. I didn't know if... I don't think that really needed a reprint. It wasn't very expensive. But I guess uh, when you have 190 Ultra Rares or whatever is in here, that's what you want to do. Let me know in the comments how excited... Boral and Dragon. Very cool card. Let me know how excited you guys are for this set. I know a lot of you guys are really excited. We have been waiting for this set for so long. Inside, there are so many good Ghost Rares. There's a Dark Magician girl the blue eyes white dragon the red eyes black dragon blue eyes ultimate dragon there's the ashuna that's a good reprint sacred waters we got the uh, victorica and contact with the void just so many good ones dark arm dragon cyber dragon red dragon arch fiend i mean wind dragon of raw sphere mode so many good ones quintet magicians ghost dragon mary planet patrol shipyard and the chimera tech fortress dragon that's a nice card i think that one actually was a few bucks so that's nice for edison too i think every deck has that in the extra deck basically mathematic edition 
We got the Ashuna, the Riptia Egg, the Adhara. So a lot of Tinny Spirits in here. Let's see what. So we're gonna see basically what you can expect from one display after we, you know, we finish with these packs right here. So so far nothing too crazy. Mystical Sand. This was like a thirty dollar common out of Astral Pack. So that's a very good reprint on a Meraki and. Uh, Hella. So uh, we know that basically that card is going to go from like 30 bucks as a common to probably like almost worthless because now you can get it super cheap as an ultra rare, which is better anyway. Code generator. We got the sandwich. Chris Drawn, Halcra Fibrax. That is a huge card. Rare fish and plunder patrol ship. This is one of the best cards er in reprints. That is not a ghost rare at least. So that's a big pull. Only one display so far and we've already pulled this. Looks like we will see if that is normal if we got lucky, but that's such a very, very big reprint. Very good hit. So we're looking all right in this beginning of this opening all right let's see if we can get a ghost rare, guys you guys can win that by the way so make sure to end the giveaway like the video be subscribed mystical sand and don't forget to turn on those notification bell all right mystical uh not mystical dark magician girl not very mystical i guess kind of mystical dd swirl slime back to back Halky fibrax whoa so i guess it doesn't have any sort of short print or anything because that would be kind of weird to get back to back Halky fibrax out of the same mini box basically because i didn't mix these up at all back to back Halky fibrax that's pretty good we don't know what the value is yet because it's so early i'm opening this like a week before well it op it's gonna come out friday and that's when everyone can post their listings that's when the real prices will come out because right now chaos greffer you can post it up for sale if you are a verified store, I think. You have to be a actual, what is it called? The Konami official, whatever it's called, store. That a Luber, the Jester of Despia. That was the best mini box ever. That had two Hockey Fibrax and one Aluber. Whoa, that was a good one, guys. You guys can win all these, by the way. Don't forget about that. All right, let's open the second one. I'm going to cut to when we've gotten all these open because it takes forever. <laughs> Number two, and as I was saying, if I, you guys don't you know, remember or from the past sets, full sets come out on Friday. Like Anyone can sell on TCG Player, but stores can sell like on Wednesday and Thursday and stuff like that. So the prices are going to be a lot higher, Outburst Dragon, because they're the only ones who can sell. So a lot of the actual... You know, inventory is going to come on to TCG player later on when everyone else can sell. And that's going to bring the price way down on a lot of different cards. So we got a zero Laplace. Very cool. And uh, that's what you need to wait for. So if you're going to buy singles for new sets, you should probably wait until then. Sometimes they will go up. So it's not always 100% accurate. Mystical Sand, Code Exporter, and DD Necro Slime. The Necro Slime got an Ultra. I love that. So uh, keep that in mind when you're buying stuff off TCG for new sets. I like to remind people every time I open a new set so that people don't buy early dragoobleon this is actually a nice reprint it was a 30 dollars card before so very good to see that in here very cool so far no ghost shares guys that's what we're looking for ghosts from the past too and we will be doing a lot of streams long streams this week so if you guys want to check those out make sure to subscribe to the channel we have protector chimera tech mega fleet and the jupiter i can't believe we already pulled a luber and two hockey fibrax that's pretty crazy Ooh, this is awesome. Oh, number 38. This is another really good reprint. All right, Baxia, that's a good card as well. Fossil Warrior Skull Knight, another card. Like, all those cards were worth, like, over 10, 15 bucks before, and now they've been reprinted and hopefully are a lot cheaper for people, which is very nice. White Beard, we got the uh, Puppet Queen, the uh, Mardell, the Trockback, the Trockback. I was going to say Talkback, then Tlackback, and those both were both wrong, obviously. So let's keep going. We got Ashuna. We got the Nine Pillars. On Ice Rebellion Dragon, we got the Onamoraki and the Hella. Very nice. Very nice. Still a lot to go in the second display. And if it is two per case, guys, well, we're about 20% in. So we're not even, we're about 40% in for a chance to actually pull one talk back or track back. I keep, can't read that thing. So let's hope we can pull one today in this video so you guys can win one. That would be pretty cool. Chimera Tech. Vision Hero Ferris. Another really nice card that's been reprinted. So this is going to be a pretty epic one for you guys. Yeah. And uh, I hope to pull some amazing stuff in the live streams as well for me. So I'm pretty excited about that. Retaliating See, I'm just happy that this set is finally here. Necroworld Banshee, Princess Cologne, and Dark Contract with the Swamp King. Very nice. Cyber Dragon. We had pretty good luck with our ghost shards the other day when we pulled one in three minutes. So that it's a little bit longer this time. Odd Eyes Rebellion Dragon, Pendulum Area, and the Dot Scaper. About half, maybe a little bit over halfway. Yeah, there's a lot of packs per display, actually. It's a lot more than last year. The Altergeist. Oh, Ruxin Special. Right to the Cypher Twin Raptors. All right. 
I feel like there's a couple of big cards we have not pulled. There's definitely a couple of big cards we have not pulled yet, but we've pulled a couple of them already in terms of the Ultra Rares, Codex Border, and the Chorus in the Sky. Blue Eyes White Dragon. Let me know your favorite pack artwork down below for this set. Blue Eyes White Dragon looks nice. And got a lot. I'm not going to lie. I say got a lie, but I'm not going to lie, I should say. Oh! Mystical Sand. We've pulled a lot of Mystical Sand, so that price is definitely going way down on the Mystical Sand for sure. Because I think it is an instant fusion target or something like that. That's why it's so expensive. Great, Great Mammoth, I think, is also another one. Alien Ammonite, Time Thief, and the Agent of Mystery with a Ghost Trick Del Han. Okay, couple packs left in this display. Let's see what we can do, guys. Hope you guys are enjoying this video. I'm so excited for Ghost from the Past 2. I know a lot of you guys are as well. A Looper, yes! Vampire Sucker and Takeover. I think all the good reprints are in the third slot. That's what it seems like. So you can get, uh, you know, Ghost Rares or you can get the big reprints in the middle. That's what it seems like. That usually is the case. They have like one slot for the best cards and it looks like that is the case, even though they're all ultra rares, except for the Ghost Rares, of course. So it doesn't, it's not rarity based. It's just how good those cards are probably there's probably a different tier of ultra rare in terms of the printing so that, that's pretty cool all right two alubers that's really nice wandering king we got the uh, yang zing with the elements of hero neos kluger dd lamia and the cypher twin raptor very cool the final pack of the second display this has been pretty good guys pretty good not gonna lie sandwich the rookie warrior lady oh and there it is our first ghost rare dark armed dragon whoa check it out guys ghost rare dark armed dragon the dad let's check out the centering terrible the uh, cutting is not too good up there either so the condition's not looking great let's check out the actual foiling let's see it looks pretty good it, what was that going on over there is that a big print line down that see that but overall compared to like the winged dragon raw this is not too bad oh a ghost rare dark arm dragon in the last pack let's check out the back oh wow it's got that scuffing from ghost from the past one it seems did you guys see that yeah it's not as bad as the previous set but it is definitely there so not the best condition overall in terms of mint condition or whatever but wow that's a beautiful card guys we've gotten you some amazing pulls so far but i don't think we end it there i think we opened another display all right, guys, we are continuing with display number three. So I really don't know how many I'm going to open. This might be the last one in terms of display. Not totally sure, but we got you guys a ghost rare, so I feel pretty good about it. Some really good pulls, but I don't want the video to be too short. since so This is the hype set that we've been waiting on. Three displays. Eh, maybe we'll see if we can go more. I don't know. Let's just see. Box of Friends, Elemental Hero. We got the Shadow Vampire and Despot 001. Very nice. Epic opening so far. I mean, this has been pretty crazy. The Dark Arm Dragon, the Dad. These live streams are going to be crazy, guys. When we're searching for that Dark Magician Girl, there's nine different ghost rares to pull from. I'm pretty excited. I think it's going to be pretty good. We got a Vampire Sorcerer. We got the Infernity Pawn. We got the Agent of Life Neptune. Very cool. Pendulum Area and Dodscaper. Let's see if we can pull a second ghost rare. Can we do it? I mean, yes, I think we can actually, but I don't know if it will be actually in here. Puppet, we got the DD Vice King, we got the Foss Fusion, and the Malefic Cyber and Dragon. Why is that in here? That's kind of weird, actually. <laughs> the Malefic Cyber and Dragon, huh? Very interessante. We got Agent of Judgment Saturn, the Nahada, the Alligator, the Codex Border, and the DD Necro Slime added again. Here we go, Blue Eyes White Dragon Pack with the Patrol Ship. We've got the Reptilian. The what is this? Go. Go, DD Divine, Zero King Rage. Go, Rage. With the Plunder Patrol brand and the Chorus of the Sky. Cyber Dragon. Let's go. Let's pull it. We got number 38. That's a good card. Baxia. The Agent of Life Neptune. The Ghost Trick. And the Dude Duodon King Kaliuga, or whatever his name is. Whew. What a crazy set. Quintet Magician. We got the Addition. We got the 97 Dragoobleon. Very cool. Infinity Sage and Red Eye Zombie Necro Dragon. A lot of zombie stuff in here, which is pretty cool. I'm a big fan of the zombie stuff, so very cool to see that. It's ghosts, so it makes sense. Ghost zombies, they kind of go together. We got the Lalage, the Crystal Beast, the Plunder Patrol, Chimeratic Fortress, and that's it. That was the last card. That was the last card. <laughs> All right. I am hyped. I am hyped, guys. Vision Hero. We got the Code Generator. The Outburst Dragon. Tiny Spirit at Hara. Vision Hero Multiply Guy. Multiply Guy. I love to see him. He's the Multiply Guy. And he will multiply our Ghost Rares into two because we have one right now. Master Flare Hyperion and the On Maraki. Yeah, the thing about the Ghost Rare, though, it doesn't, like, show from the side or anything. Like, I had no idea we were getting that dad. It just popped up. Ghost Expector. Oh! 
Another ghost? Wait, is it super case? Are we gonna have to keep opening or do we just pull both of them for you guys? Red Dragon Archfiend. This is gonna be the best giveaway ever. You can win two ghost rares. Pretty good giveaway. Red Dragon Archfiend Ghost Rare. Centering, guys. Is centering gonna be an issue in this set? We haven't had centering as an issue in like years, but the centering is awful on both these ghost rares. Red Dragon Archfiend. I mean, the foil looks nice. So you'd rather be centering than the foil, right? Because the foil looks beautiful. Ooh, that is nice. Okay. Okay. And the back looks, yeah, it's okay. It's got some print lines, got some scuffing on it. So, so yeah, these are probably not going to be super easy to grade, to be honest, based on what I'm seeing. But wow, double ghosts, double ghosts. Okay, I'm starting to think there's a third ghost right here. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I mean, okay, everyone was saying it was two per case, but uh, we saw what happened with, you know, all the influencers. Not that they had the same case or whatever, but they were, uh, they were pulling ghosts left and right. So let's see if maybe... We can pull some goes left and right, because so far we're doing it. This has been, this is going to be a crazy giveaway. This has, like, got to be one of the best giveaways I've ever done. Two Ghost Rares, two Aluber Jester of Despia, and two Christian Hawk Fibrex. That's pretty insane. The Flint Cragger, the Ryza, the Mega Monarch. That's the first time we pulled him. He's a good Reaper, and he was, like, 70, 50 to 70 bucks. I found two in bulk. One was, one time when it was 70, one time when it was 50. So I made a ton of money, because I had them listed previously, like, 40 cents. So that was pretty nice that I that I accidentally unlisted those. Okay, and then the Tinny Ad Spirit Ad Hara. I can't believe you pulled two Goshers and three displays. That is insane. Sam Sarah, we got the DD Swirl Slime. We got the Protector of the Agents. We gotta open one more now, right? Like if you've pulled a ghost out of two out of three, you gotta open one more display. Wandering King with Yang Zing. Oh, Rux and Special with the Neos Kluger and Despian. I've never heard of the Neos Kluger. Is that a new card? I know some of these cards are new, like a couple of them, but not many. They're imports, at least, I think. Galaxy Soul, that's a good card. Okay. We got the uh, Agent of Enthropy, Uranus. Oh, Uranus, huh? When you've pulled two out of three Ghost Rares, you open a fourth display. That's how this works. All right, we are officially back with the fourth display. And because I was going to do three displays, then we pulled a Ghost Rare, and I'm like, wait a second. Could we pull a third Ghost Rare out of these? I mean, we're going to find out. Outburst Dragon, and it, this is Ghost from the past, too. This is where we take it beyond what we were expecting, you know? We're expecting to do one to two displays in the first video. No, no. We're, we're going past that. This is Ghost from the past, too. We go crazy. We've gotten two Ghost Rares. By the way, I'll be giving away, so make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like the video. Leave a comment down below, and, of course, turn on that notification bell. Rise of the Mega Monarch, that's another one. These are uh, kind of clumping together, it seems, but uh, not really clumped because they're in different displays just back-to-back -back displays which is kind of interesting okay we got the void cauldron we got the shell knight the uh joe munganer all right I, I don't know what i was trying to say there but that was a lot of consonants in the same like into the word that was very confusing the rookie warrior lady the dd vice requiem the yangzing and the tangy spirit very beautiful Let's see what we can do, guys. Make sure you guys tune in for those live streams this week. It's going to be so much fun. The Ferris. Okay, beautiful. We are pulling a lot of good cards. Vion, that's the first time we've seen that one. I know there are a lot of ultra rares, but it seems like, since you know, you get all ultra rares in the same pack unless you pull a ghost rare, the Ancient Sanctuary in the Sky Chaos. Greffer, the Brood Enforcer, and Manju of the 10,000 Hands. Another printing of Manju. Okay, guys, this has been already a crazy opening. Ghost from the Past 2 is not disappointing. Of course, Doppel Warrior. Fallen Sanctuary, Mystical Shine Ball. We've got a Chimera Tech Fortress, a Dragon. Very nice. These Ghost Rares are amazing. I love these sets. Ghost from the Past 1, I loved it, even though it wasn't that great. Ghost from the Past 2, I love it because it is that great. Vampire Duke. And speaking of great, I've been talking about Ghost from the Past and some many other things on Rux and Live, my other channel. So if you guys want to go check that out, go check it out, Rux and Live. Go hang out. We can do, there's little discussions we do over there, you know? Openings here and other things there. So if you want to see things besides opening, go check it out. I appreciate you guys following over on that channel. That's pretty cool. I like having a second channel. It's fun. Far it, Faris. Ferris, because then it, you know, it's less stressful because this channel, it's like, okay, we need to get, you know, some big quality videos out there, open some awesome stuff. With that one, it's like, doesn't really matter. Let's do whatever we want. Chaos Graffer, we got the Princess Cologne and the Dark Contract with the Swamp King. Very cool. Very cool. This one feels like a no ghost rare display. I don't know. It just, it just does. Rookie Warrior Lady. Despia. Cool. Outburst Dragon. We got the Infinity Sage. And Red Eyes Zombie Necro Dragon. For some reason, I thought I was like, whoa. I, I bumped my mouse and I was like, did I stop the recording? No, I didn't stop the recording. So it's all good. You guys can still see me. You can still hear me. You can see the cards. All the things are still going. Master, Pele Master Flare, not Peace. Hyperion, Fortress Dragon. So total, if we open four displays, that'd be 80 packs, I think. 80 packs. That's a lot of packs. Rise of the Mega Monarch. That's a playset. We hadn't pulled one yet. Now we've pulled a playset. Oh, I love this guy. The Multiply Guy. Just a clutch name. 
Still a lot of packs to go in this fourth display. Not a lot, but a few. Okay. Nine pillars. Let's get that Dark Magician girl, guys. The Blue Eyes White Dragon. The Ghost Trick. Mystic Sign Ball. Not Mystic. Mystical Shine Ball. Very cool. The uh, Geomath Mech Final Sigma. The Fossil Machine. The Agent of Life. Vampire Domination. And the Hella Generator Boss of Doom. Of Doom. I'm doomed. Okay. Beautiful. Proxy Horse. Agent of Creation, Venus, DDD, Vice King, the On Moraki, and the Prane. Two more packs on this display. I think we already... I thought that was a ghost rare. That's another one of those fake ghost rares. It looks like a ghost rare, but it's not. All right, and the final pack, Dark Magician Girl. Is this where the video ends? Oh no, the end of the video. No more Ruxin today, but don't worry. There's more videos. Number 38. Very cool. You can watch any of them. Malefic, Cyber, and Dragon. Is that where we end or should we round it out with an even half case? The final display of this video. You guys will be able to win all of this stuff. One of you guys. It's going to be pretty amazing. I'm pretty excited for one of you guys. But we're opening up five because this is Ghost from the Past 2. We're not taking a day off. We're not making it easy. We're not having a short video to display. No. We're doing half a case in this video. I wouldn't do a full case, but like, come on. That guys, that's just entirely too long. We're going to be seeing tons of cases, though, on the channel. If you guys want to see long videos, you want to see me open a ton of these packs, you want to be there for it. Ruxin 34 live streams coming up this week. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Just click that red button down there. If it's red, you have a problem. If it's gray, you're doing great. If it's red, there's something going on with your computer. You might want to fix it. Might be a virus. Could be something like that. You want to check it out. Shell Knight and just, just knock it out. You Mind you, very nice. We don't want that to happen to you guys. That's all I'm saying. Halka Fibrax. So we're back-to-back -back packs for Halka Fibrax. Fi blah, 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 blah. Fi Halka Fibrax. Ryza. And we have not pulled it since. So maybe it is short printed. I don't know. Shorter printed, I should say, than other old Ultras. I would guess it is probably. Flick Cragger. Fossil Machine. We got some in our throat there. Okay, Tinny Spirit. It was like, wow, you are you are opening a lot of packs in this video, buddy. You gotta slow down. We've had a lot of long videos recently. Like for a long time we didn't have long videos. Now we're having a lot of long videos. So I uh, hope you guys like them because they're very long. <laughs> and by the way, if you guys missed yesterday's video, we had some issues with the upload. The Shadow Infinity box may or two boxes actually go check that video out it didn't do that great because i accidentally released it only 12 minutes of the actual footage of the 30 minute video so go watch that video it was crazy it was fun that's an old school box there's 53 total old school packs opened pretty awesome very cool so uh go check that one out guys because that was a pretty good video and uh yeah there will be more here for ghosts from the past two as well coming up but that's not today. This is the one you're going to get for today. Despoon Tragedy. This is a probably 30-ish minute video. Maybe a little shorter than that for you guys. Yeah, you're welcome. You're welcome, guys. We've got the Chimera Tech and the Agent. So, pretty excited about this. Pretty excited. We'll probably be doing some other videos with Ghost from the Past 2 as well. Potentially against Rhyme Style. Galaxy, very nice. Cyber Twin and the Insector Hornet. Very cool. What else do we got? We got Proxy Horse. Agent of Creation. Oh, the Odd Eyes Rebellion and the Yang Zing Piranha. All right. So a lot of packs to go. Did we pull both ghosts out of my case for you guys? I don't know. You guys might have sniped both my ghosts, or maybe there's a third ghost. Who knows? Tandy Spirit, Sacred Waters, the Victoria. That also looks kind of like a ghost rare. It shines like a ghost. Come on. These things are tricky, guys. You got to be careful. All right. Retaliating C, the Agent of Force, the Skull Knight. That's only the second time we pulled the Skull Knight and the Chorus in the Sky. Very beautiful. Five packs remaining. This is one mini box plus one pack. We kind of Maritech or Rampage Retaliating C. Wasn't this the one that was in the OTS? Deco Togger Heat Soul. This is a big one. This is a new one. That's really good. The Primal Dragon. It's the first time we've pulled it too, I think. Unless I just skipped over it, which is possible. Because it is a link. So sometimes, you know, it's like Link. Uh, not that great. Let's keep moving. Um, I've got the Rampage Dragon. Vision Hero Ferris. Again, very nice. And Ghost Trick Delahan. Three packs remaining. This is a Cyber Dragon artwork. Does that mean we're going to pull the Cyber Dragon? That's the question. Ghost Trick Spectre. Tatsunekro. Oh, cool. Tatsunoko. Got a uh, upgrade, I guess. Vion. Two packs to go in our opening, guys. Hey, if you have enjoyed this, make sure to subscribe to the channel. This is 100 packs of Ghosts from the Past, by the way. 100 pack opening. Vampire Increase. Very cool. So I guess that could be a nice title. Uh, 100 pack opening of Ghosts from the Past 2. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Final pack, two ghost rares. You guys can win all these. Don't forget to enter the giveaway down below. We got the Cornucopius. The, so let's go from the back like this. The uh, Kaliuga, the Ghost Trick, and the final card of the opening. Will it be a third ghost rare? Here we go. Blue Eyes White Dragon. 
Ooh, I thought it might be something with those synchros. Synchros always just make you think Ghost Rider for some reason, probably because the originals. But if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic content like this. Shout out to CCG, Truster Cards, Tonefo Show, Tomato Juice, Stanley Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, Daxter Yumus, Junior Riding, and High Show, JT Cho, David FJ, and Josh Evans. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.